Hi, this is Narendran again from Binsara Limited. In today's lecture, I am going to walk you through update operation in ReactJS using hooks and axios. So let us start. Okay, uh, update is very simple. Uh, we'll create a on click event here, on click event here, with on click event. We will say uh, update. So I will say update and I'm going to say item dot category ID. Yeah, so item dot category ID here. So you're going to pass the category ID when button is clicked. Okay, and we're going to create that function here function <coughs> update pass ID. Uh, after that console dot log id so we're gonna see if we are getting id or not if you're getting id we are successful so console dot inspect that and in console here we are getting id we are getting id we are getting id correct so that's fine so just clear that off now for a sec so we're gonna get now we're gonna uh, uh, what we're gonna do as we're getting id uh, props dot history dot push so we're gonna push that into another page where update pages so history dot push this onto the page name called update uh, update but we are going to pass id with it okay uh, so the here is the update page. So you're gonna pass now <coughs> from here to this update page here. Uh, so to make the video shorter, I'm gonna copy everything from here and and I'm gonna put that there. Control C, Control V here, and after that, uh, so up to handle function here. Sorry up to submit and handle function here control c and uh, hang on so i'm going to declare props here props so i don't forget that now i'm going to paste that here uh, uh, so we don't need this remove function sorry we don't need this remove function so we're going to delete that control is to save and we're going to get the form up from here so the form control c get the form from here and control d so control v control s to save we got the form and now what we're going to do simple um, here because we are passing id from the other uh, page so here we are we are going to store that in a variable const id equal to uh, properties dot match uh, dot parameters dot id okay and we're going to pass that id on to this url here so we're going to pass id here <coughs> after passing the id uh, so you can uncomment that we can see we are getting id in here set data not category okay and control is to save and uh, see if you're getting it so update we are getting that so it's fine cool so now we will start <coughs> update i mean submit so here we got the record when you are clicking that so when we submit that it should update so for that uh, come to submit here and here also we need id so const id we want to store that in a variable uh, sorry not console const yeah id equal to properties dot match parameters dot params dot id okay and we're going to pass that id uh, well we're going to use put function here for update and we're going to pass the id in here okay so we are passing the id there okay control s to save after that we don't need this one okay 
because we are going to push that uh, so properties dot history dot push on to the main page that is this one so we can see the list once it is updated so once this record is updated it will push to the uh, the uh, front page or category page whatever uh, to see the to show the list view okay so that's what we're gonna see i'm gonna change that into test and submit it and it's done and cars i'm gonna change that into all cars here and i'm gonna submit submit it so here you can see it is getting updated okay so this is all for this video and uh, thank you for listening uh, have a good day